Yo, what up? It's Ray Noble. We got five questions, five songs. Let's get it. Um, first song that comes to mind when I think of my hometown, Palmerston North. Um, for me, it's My City by Kid Leroy and One Four. I'm like the jail to Drake in my city. So what they say, they won't say that shit to me. I'm in that town my brothers. Crazy production. I got a couple of my mates that are on that production too. It's just like, you know, repping your, the song about repping where you're from. And, and I feel like Kid Leroy won four, like where they're from and making it on a world stage is so cool. It's just so like inspiring. So like every time, like we ever touch down in, in Palmy or, or drive into, into Palmy, I'm either putting that up loud as in my AirPods or through my car speakers and we're just cruising it. Rosanna by Toto. If I heard that anywhere, like you'd be playing any sort of song, I'm probably not gonna like, man, it's not gonna affect me. But if Rosanna came on by Toto, yo, we're going into the dance floor. Straight, straight mosh pit. Fucking at the old home. Toto comes on. <laughs> what does that mean? Epitomize to be a perfect example of. Oh, okay. It's, it, that's a hard one because there was a lot of music going around. Like I was um, performing a lot as a musician, like young for my for my dad and like and and bands, friends, and then making music, and then also like doing a lot of DJing and like house parties. So I feel like there's a lot of songs that sum that up. But if I have to pick one, maybe "Wild for the Night" by. Skrillex featuring ASAP Rocky. Wake up feeling blessed, uh, you on that dress, uh, I feel like a bit in that song is just really represents my teenage years. Like, it was fun, it was careless, like, you know, just doing dumb shit, we're doing whatever. More my top song from 2021, probably Anson Pack, Bruno Mars, Silk Sonic, um, their first single. Um, Leave the door open. What you doing? What you doing? Where you at? Where you at? Oh, you That's got a cool plans. song. Like I'm a big fan of sort of reamping of like that 70s sound. For me, that's like a style that I've been personally playing around with as a producer um, and a musician a lot over the last sort of year. So it's cool to see those sort of top tier artists come out and and go into a project that is focused around that. For me, it's just like it's just timeless. My top karaoke song would be Dancing Queen by ABBA. It's just a good song. Good, great, fun song. It's a classic, you know. It was one of my parents' sort of like phase or one of their classics. So that's what I'm getting up, and I'm singing the shit out of that. Um, one song of mine that I'm excited about is my new single High Again, which recently dropped and it's a song that I've crafted, I guess, or like maybe came back to over and over again um, over the course of like the last three years and it's a song that had a lot of meaning to me um, and it's also the start of the first single of my EP, which is a whole story of different events and things about my life um, and that's just one small piece of it and to me that's super exciting.